Hello, Malika. Miss Pipitone here. And if you can't tell by my pajama shirt, I miss my students and everyone at school. But not only am I here to tell you how much I miss you guys, I'm here for your bedtime story. So we're going to be reading Happy Right Now. It's a book by Julie Berry, illustrated by Holly Hatam. So I'm excited. Let's get right into it. <clears throat> Here we go. I'll be happy when I get a puppy, a unicorn, an ice cream sundae, and a castle with a friendly dragon. Or I can be happy right now. I'll be happy when the clock clicks the last second of the school day on the last Friday before vacation. Or I can be happy right now. happy when everyone adores me for being brilliant, brave, beautiful, popular, and amazing. Or I can like me right now and be happy just as I am. I'll be happy when the worry monkey gets off my back and my chores are done and nobody's grumpy. Take a look at her list of chores here. Do you guys have the same chores? Or I can feed the worry monkey a banana and party with him on a jungle gym. We'll both be happy right now. Why not? I'll be happy when the rainstorm slows, the icicles melt, the clouds leave town, and the sun says, come play. Or I can be happy any day in mittens, in boots, or in soaking wet puddles. Wetter is better anyway. I'll be happy when this sneezing stops. No more sniffles and drips, no coughs, no ick, and I feel better. And I understand that feeling. Being sick is really not fun. Or I can be cozy right now and snuggle down for a sleepy snooze. And if it's up to me to choose, why lose time being gray, being blue? All I need to do is be happy right now, whatever the day, whatever the weather. I like to cozy up too. But, but what about when happy right now is a no can do? When the troubles and sadness are much too much and feeling my feelings is all I can do. Like a long goodbye or a puppy I'd cry or slow sorrows with no good answer to why. Sometimes it does, I do feel like that. Well, that's okay too. I can breathe right now. In is one, out is two. Breathe again, fill my belly, let it flow out slowly. Did you guys try it? Feel my body relax. Let my bones turn to jelly. It's a great way to meditate, guys. Remember, a now that was happy, breathe. Borrow an old smile from a brighter day. Know that happy will find me again soon. Give a hug and get one. Help somebody. Learn something new. Draw a picture. Bake a cake. Talk it out, let it go. Take a nap or take two. I'll be happy when I'm hopeful, cheerful, helpful, and thankful. Reaching out for happy until I can grab it. No dragons required. But I would like a rabbit. So guys, I really like this story because it's been hard for me to stay happy not being at school. So I use the meditation tips and the breathing and the baking cakes and the relaxing to help me get through this until I can see you guys again. 
and I hope it's really soon. I hope you enjoyed your bedtime story. Bye!